what are termite shields and will they prevent termites? Hey, it's Craig with Anchor Foundation Repair and I'm gonna point out termite shields in an old pier and beam home and discuss if they're effective or not. And my answer is generally always gonna be they're nice to have in a crawl space. Uh, some areas, they're code requirements. And I think the intent is that they prevent termites and normally I see that they do, but in this case, they haven't. Here's a stack of concrete uh, blocks uh, embedded in poured concrete down here for the base. And on top of that is a thin little sheet metal, uh, just a simple termite shield. The theory is that termites are gonna crawl up because they wanna get to this meaty, moist uh, wooden material that they can chew up on here. And this termite shield is gonna prevent them from going up and around, or maybe in this case, up and around, and then back on that wood. I just noticed that these termite shields in this house are not effective. They were not working. Uh, here's that channel, that tunnel of uh, termites coming up this concrete block. There's nothing active in them right now, but you can see on the bottom of that termite shield right there that they chewed around and then they came around an inch underneath the bottom side of this termite shield and then transitioned back up bound to where they created this tunnel right there. So in general, termite shields are a good idea for homes. Uh, in this case, they do not 100% prevent termite damage from occurring. And the best way to do that is to ensure that you have a dry, clean uh, crawl space that doesn't hold moisture, doesn't hold dampness, and you're on a treatment term or termite treatment plan and monitoring.